on and go, go, go in a Plymouth. A go-kart through and through. You really go, go, go for a Plymouth. And Plymouth will really go for you. And now, Plymouth. The one car in the low price field that gives you the big difference in 1959 presents the Plymouth Show, starring your musical host, Lawrence Welk. <laughs> my friends and a warm welcome to the Plymouth show our entire musical family is on hand to bring you some music and fun our opening number a popular rhythm tune goody goody one two to New Orleans, we ran across a talented youngster who loves to play the piano. He has an outstanding command of the keyboard and would like to have you folks meet talented Robert Rue, nine years of age. Robert, take it away. An encore. Sure. How about uh, box alpacetto? Okay. Okay, you play it.
you very much, Robert. And this last number we played for all the folks down in New Orleans. Is that right? That's right. Robert is only nine years of age. He tells me he practices two hours every day. And he also tells me that they don't have to make him practice. He likes to do it. Is that right? That's right. Good. And we're going to bring him back to uh, play an encore for you later on in the show. It looks like Dick Dale has a problem when he calls on Alice Lawn. Let's join them and hear all about it. When we go out, no matter where we're found, there is always somebody around. She brings her father, her mother, her sister, and her brother. Oh, I never see Maggie alone. She brings her uncles and cousins. She's got them by the dozen. I never see Maggie alone. She brings her father, her mother, her sister, and her brother. Oh, I never see Maggie alone. I am her father, her mother, and I'm her little brother. And we never leave Maggie alone. One night when they were out walking and they got tired of talking, she invited him up to our home. I turned the lights down. They were too bright. Oh, what a night. When I turned on the light. There was her father, her mother, her little baby brother. Oh, I never see Maggie alone. It gets kind of crowded. I never see Maggie alone. Oh, what a pity. I never see Maggie alone. Pete and his clarinet, along with all the music makers, give us a fine arrangement of an old-time favorite, Time on My Hands. One, and two, and Pete and Fellows. We just learned that Cubby O'Brien, our drummer, dancer, and singer from the Junior Orchestra, also plays the bongos. 
Copy, will you please come in? This is something new. We didn't realize that you played this instrument, too. Oh, yes, I've been practicing. <laughs> How long have you been working on those? Oh, I'd say about two years, I guess. You have, huh? Well, don't keep those secrets from us. <laughs> How about you uh, leading the orchestra this evening at the same time? Well, that would be fine. Good. Thank you. You ready, boys? All ready. A one, a two. <laughs> folks, the name of that song was a one and a two. Isn't that right? Right. You see what happens when I turn my bag around here? That was written by our musical conductor, musical supervisor, George Cates. And now we continue the Plymouth show with our talented trombone section. Pete Lofthouse, Kenny Trimble, Barney Liddell, and Jimmy Henderson. The song, East of the Sun. One and two. <laughs> one of the millions of American families that will buy a new car in 1959, 
And the next few minutes may make a big difference in your final decision on which car to buy. You see, there's a big difference in automobiles. And only when you know what that big difference is can you be sure that you're getting the best car for your money. Now today, the three most popular cars in America are priced all within a few dollars of each other. But that's where the similarity ends. From there on, there's a big difference. And Plymouth got it. Now compare Plymouth's clean styling and luxurious look to that of its competitors. Yes, there's a big difference, all right. And there's a big difference in features, too. Features like Plymouth's exclusive new swivel seats that swing you out when you leave, swing you in when you enter. And only Plymouth can give you new push-button heating and defrosting, the world's simplest heater control. And only Plymouth offers you advanced push-button drive. Now, Plymouth offers you the big difference in performance and economy with the Golden Commando 395, the biggest engine in the low-price field. And when it comes to driving ease, well, here's the big difference. Only Plymouth has full-time power steering. Now, when it comes to riding quality, Plymouth gives you the big difference with famous Torsion Air Ride, the expert's choice of the finest ride on the road today. Well, so it goes, feature after feature. Plymouth gives you the big difference. But you discover Plymouth's big difference for yourself. See your Plymouth dealer tomorrow and take a two-mile tryout. And on this two-mile tryout, you will soon discover that the big difference today in the low-price field is not the price, but in the car. And Plymouth got it. Thank you. Friends, as you know, on this Plymouth show, we have two orchestras. And at this time, we would like to have you meet our junior music makers with some very fine dancing by our drummer, Bo Wagner. Gentlemen, one. again and uh, we can always depend uh, that our lovely Lennon sisters bring us some nice songs. Here they are this evening to sing May You Always. No worries, stay too long. 
go way too far, we have to have more of that fine singing. We're going to listen to some champagne styling now for great show tune, Manhattan. One. ago, one of our fine arrangers, Luke Waddling, wrote a great big hit tune called Sam Song. Larry Dean will sing it for you at this time. Here's a happy tune you love to croon. They call it Sam Song. Catchy as can be the melody. They call it Sam Song. On your mind, and then you'll find you're humming Sam song. Why it makes you grin, gets under your skin, as only a song can do. People that you meet out on the street are whistling Sam song. Everyone you see will soon agree that it's a grand song. 
forget your troubles and wear a smile. You'll find you'll never go wrong. If you learn to cruise the happy tune, they call it Samsung. You're out of dough and feeling low, just whistle Samsung. I will guarantee you'll soon agree that it's a grand song. So forget your troubles and wear a smile. You'll find you'll never go wrong if you learn to prove. Another talented, handsome young fella, 17-year-old Warren Looning from our junior band joins the big band for the well-known Victor Herbert tune, Indian Summer. One and two. <laughs> a great trumpet man. Our character actor, Aladdin, becomes the center of attention for the lovely Leonard sisters as they sing about uh, old folks. Coffee. 
tucks his napkin up under his chin. And that yellow cup mine, it's so mellow, it's ripe. But you needn't be ashamed of him. In the evening after supper, the stars For Lincoln's that day. Lord, we know that one so well. Don't quite understand about old folks. Did he fight for the blue or the gray? For he's so diplomatic and so democratic. We always let him have his way. Every Friday he'll go fishing way down on Buzz's Bay. But he only hooks a perch or two, a whale got away. should buy? Yes, I'm as confused as you, that's true, cause I've been shopping for a week or two. Now the prices seem just about the same, but there's a difference, I'll stake my name. You said it, friend, just follow me, we'll tour this plant and then you'll see. Today, there's a big difference, and Plymouth's got it. Today, there's a big difference, and Plymouth's got it. A different look and a different feel. A totally different automobile. Great new line so long and low. A new sport deck for great new show. Come on inside, we'll make it clear that Plymouth is ahead this year. Talk about different, I'm crazy about those swivel seats that swing you out.
your next a musical salute to the Hoosier State with the fine Georgetown arrangement of Indiana, featuring our trumpet section, Georgetown, Rocky Rockwell, Norman Bailey, and Art DePue. One, and two, and three. <laughs> little champagne lady Alice Lawn looks especially nice tonight in a lovely black and gold gown. Alice sings, oh look at me now. I'm not the girl who cared about love and I'm not the girl who cared about fortune. Never cared much, oh look at me now. music we bring you a beautiful song titled Our Love, arranged by our good friend Bob Ballard. Gentlemen.
you very much, ladies and gentlemen. This past Monday evening, we flew to Washington, D.C., where we had the pleasure and privilege to entertain at the White House, following a state dinner honoring Vice President Nixon and the members of the cabinet. After we finished our concert, our good president made a special request for one of his favorite tunes. Well, we kind of muffed things up by playing the original instead of the familiar melody. Larry Hooper and Tiny Little will rectify everything with the popular version of the Yellow Rose of Texas. Gentlemen, swing out. We know the song, at least we, we learned it. Um, Freckle Face Brian Seedman was a big hit in Washington. Everyone loved him. In fact, he stole the show at the White House. Brian, bring your uke and let's hear that big voice. All right. Thank you, Mr. Wolf. He was just a kid, a little red hand pug nose kid. And oh, he was his mother's pride and joy. He was worse than Peck's bad boy. I lived right next door. the up-to-date ease and convenience of Plymouth's new swing-out swivel seat and the unrestricted view through Plymouth's big glass canopy windshield. But most important of all for a jet age guy, all you gotta do is push a button and go. Bouncy coil springs are a thing of the past in this car. Plymouth's constant level torsion air makes driving as easy as floating on a cloud. So if you live the way you like and like the way you live, get next to your Plymouth dealer right away. Like Jet Captain Bill Magruder, you'll really go for Plymouth. And Plymouth will really go for you. Thank you. Rocky Rockwell and his junior partner, Cuppy O'Brien, with the tune made so very famous by that uh, great vaudeville entertainer, Bird Williams. The song, Nobody. Life's 
seems full of clouds and rain and i am filled with naught but pain who sues my thumping bumping brain nobody when winter comes with snow and sleet and me with hunger and cold feet who says here's two bits go and eat nobody i ain't never done nothing to nobody Never got nothing from nobody, no time. And until I get something from somebody, sometime I don't intend to do nothing for nobody, no time. When I try hard and scheme and plan to look the best as e'er I can. Who says, look at that handsome man? Nobody. When all day long things go amiss and I go home to find some bliss, who hands to me a glowing Yes. Nobody. I ain't never done nothing to nobody. I ain't never got nothing from nobody. No time. And until I get something from somebody sometime I don't intend to do nothing for nobody no time no I don't intend to do nothing for nobody no Rockwell and Cubby O'Brien. Our piano guest from New Orleans, Robert Rue, returns to play Mozart's Sonata, from which the popular song 18th Century Drawing Room was taken. Robert, we're all set for you. Thank you. 
29 years of age and he plays so wonderful, so clean. I don't know what it is about those folks from New Orleans. They're all such outstanding musicians. We have El Hurt down there that's been an hour show. Great trumpet man, and then we have Pete Fountain. Oh, by the way, let's hear from Pete Fountain and all the fellas with the Royal Garden Blue.